Hey there, Chasey. You want a job? Sure. As long as it doesn't involve riding animals around. Uh, then I got bad news, because it kinda does. Really? What is it? It's someone I know wants the giant robot Tyrannosaurus Rex stolen from the museum. A Tyrannosaurus? Rex? Who, uh, would want that? My private buyer. But trust me, he's nobody you'd want to meet. He's starting to be a real c Yeah, I shouldn't say. Just give me a call once you got it out of the museum. Sure thing, Vinny. Oh. Oh. Ellie, I think I've got a lead on the Fury case. In Bluebell National Park? Uh, no. Vinny called me about a job at the museum. I've got to steal a robotic Tyrannosaurus Rex. Okay. If my uncle calls to find out where you are, I'll square it with him. Thanks. And maybe don't tell the chief just yet? <laughs> sure. Farmer Hayes? Ah, perfect. You ain't seen any of my pigs, have you? The ones I just rounded up? Uh, yeah. I turned my back and they hoofed it again. They'll be all over Lego City by now. If you could just keep an eye out, I would be indebted to you. No hurry or anything. Yes, Mr. Hayes. Great. And if you do find one, just pop it back in the nearest pig cannon, and they'll be fired right back here. Okay. Yeah! Oh, hello. And today, well, because he is on the other team undercover party. Hey. And now, uh, this is going to be one of my uh, this mission right here. We're going to do we want to see the T Rex, and this is probably one of my most favorite, my or oh, probably my top five, or if not, probably my um, one of my uh, what's it called most favorite missions of all the time based on how cool and how good it's a mission. And, I tr and trust me, the mission is pretty, it's pretty fun. Y'all will see that in the bit. So now all I gotta do is trying to... Oh, I didn't even see that. Now all I gotta do is trying to go to the, the museum over there. Ellie, I'm at the museum, but I don't see a way in. Yeah, I checked the blueprints. The only way in is from the rooftop, but there's no way to climb up there. It's okay. I've got an idea. Are there any taller buildings around here which can be climbed? Maybe the art gallery? Why? I just got hold of a chicken. I can use it to glide from the art gallery's roof to the museum's. Wow! That is not a sentence I thought I'd hear today. Good luck, Chase. I bought too much. We have to glide from the art gallery to the museum. It should be pretty interesting. Get out of my way, please. When those, when those random NPCs, when they have their sirens on, I never understand why. I just, I really don't. And, and they were trying to like follow them or whatever. I don't think they really go anywhere. I think they just keep on driving and driving. Doesn't really make much sense, but what, hey, whatever. Alright, now I do is just climb up here. Any secret, um, secrets around here. 
Well, I guess there's nothing. Yeah. Half day holiday. Yes. Now, I don't think you have to water um, um, water this one because you could, you could basically climb up here uh, while um, even watering the first one. Alright, I did destroy um, all, the, um, all of these. Create a big fan. Alright. All right. We're getting pretty close to it. I make the little um, climbing team. Alright. Oh, you can't even climb up there. What? Yep. We won't climb. We won't not climb. We won't glide all the way over there. And I think this one time I actually made it there while even using the um, while eat while using the little um, the little chick um not the chick yeah the chicken thing. And this one, you you have to get all of these like the green circles. But if you don't like like I think even if you miss one, you you probably will fail the jump. You have to do it all over again. I'm trying my best to go over there. Alright, cool. We made it. <laughs> there was a blue... St hey, look, there's a pig up here. I think. I just saw it at the last second. Oh. Yeah, he... Yeah, he looked right over there. Well, he has to be there, um, uh, I'm gonna stay right there for now. I'm afraid. Just like I use a grappling hook. Grapple gun. Now I do is climb up here. And it's a super brick. Thank you. <laughs> Special assignment number eight. The claw the colossal fossil hustle. About this job, Chase. Consider a payback for how much the gift shop charged for that dinosaur pen when you were 11. It's almost like a heist, basically. Feathers. Four letters. Hmm. Hmm. Down? No, across. <laughs> What? Yeah, it gets destroyed. And, and I'm destroying your um, desk. I also like the music in this one. Alright. I just called Sheriff Huckleberry, and he told me that he hasn't seen you in hours. Where are you? Elite came up, Chief. 
and I think it points straight to Rex. So, not only have you ignored my orders, you're probably about to take something expensive again. Are you sure this is connected with Fury? Yes. Vinny's asked me to get the museum's robotic Tyrannosaurus Rex for someone. It can't just be a coincidence. That does sound like Fury's style. All right, I'll let you follow this one, McCain. But if it doesn't lead to Fury, then that T-Rex won't be the only extinct thing around here. I don't think it's really important. This is the largest known silver Lego ingot to ever be found in the Bluebell Mine, discovered by Silas Fletcher when it fell on top of him. It was kindly donated. Alright, who on this? Alright. The blue stud right here. I can't believe I almost got ran over in a museum. Alright, easy. This steam locomotive was unveiled at the opening of Lego City's very first train station. It wasn't used until two years later, when a second station was finally built. The reason why I'm pressing those buttons, that was, no, those um, buttons, that's because just to hear a little bit of dialogue. Just because. I'll just make you sure. This is the historic Lego City Tram, which was sold by con artist Tricky Jimmy to no less than 12 separate customers, all of whom neglected to notice that their receipts clearly stated, carriage is not included. And it totally shows like one, uh, the whole police shield, one percent. This oil derrick is over a hundred years old. Oil derricks are named after. Let me see what this is about. Back 
and these kind of missions, even though they could be exciting and all, but these missions take like like time. It takes a while just to get to the fun part. Well, that's alright. Well, actually, I won't. I don't think I really mind doing all this. What is this? I think you actually control this. Whoa, I'm gonna jump off. Yep. Got my way, fish. This pirate ship was painstakingly reconstructed from 843. The dinosaur exhibit. Ooh, great! I could use that super. T-Rex is bound Those to be in there. Those things are awesome. He's <laughs> like multiple dialogue. What is this? The last one. What is this about? Professor Patrick Palmer was the founder of Apollo Island, a scientist since he was eight. It... Alright, can I jump on this? Okay, no more. And I'm thinking that me, many people who play this game and like other YouTube channels for rock for like walkthroughs. I don't think um they don't really push those do those kind of things, but I'm doing them just for extra dialogue. Just because I think this is that the last one I'm pretty I'm sure. Yep, right there. Pretty easy. Now, if you ever want to, now, now guys, if you ever want to, um, what's it called? Um, hmm, get all the police shields to these kind of special assignments. I would, oh, okay. I would, I would recommend doing this once you have all the guys, like, like all. Like one, two, three, four, five, eight, five, eight, five, eight, five, eight. When you have like all eight disguises on up. So that you want to keep on like going back and back and forth, back and forth. whatever all right I know what to do oh I just missed it all right let me see what this is about cut up wall okay I did not mean to do that Messing with that for whatever. 
Yeah, there's a lot of guards in here. I'm gonna call you, I'm gonna call you red. Okay. Well, that certainly isn't a T-Rex. One of the best-known facts about pterodactyls is that they have a silent pee, which they use to blind their prey before attacking. You can't get in here. Right here. What is this? Oh, a feather. I have no idea what's wrong with that guy in the background. And that isn't a T-Rex either. This mighty dinosaur has a series of blade-like bones running along its back. Some scientists think it may have been used as a tool by bigger dinosaurs to cut bread. That is not true, what he just said. Obviously. This place is impenetrable. <gasps> Can I smell burning? Now those um like little theaters or whatever, a little museum exhibits or whatever you want to call them. No, those are only there just to get just to get a lot of super bricks for that for that build over there. But if but if, but if you already have like enough, well then well you don't have to do them. But I'm gonna do it either way just because. Just to, just to get, just to have Although more. Although this peaceful dinosaur had a vegetarian diet, it was deadlier than a Where is the T-Rex? If I ran this place, it'd be right in the middle, being all Rawr! Either because it was preyed upon by other dinosaurs, or because it... All right. Now, how can do you... Oh, and, uh, great. They haven't built the T-Rex exhibit yet. I better yeah. find some super bricks. You know, yeah. this is exactly how stuff like the Brontosaurus happens. Huh? Yeah, three thousand. And each of these are um, little exhibits or whatever. These have like little mini games to it. These rare totems have been designed to spin around at great speed, mimicking the tribal dance of the people who built them. However, they are unable to mimic the latter stages of the dance where the participants fall over and moan about feeling ill. And the thing about the push it green if it's like correct order. So I think this is right, most likely, yeah. And I think we do this one more time. Yeah, there we go.
So we can't go in there yet. Coming soon, an exciting diorama showing what scientists believe our future will look like. Pending completion until we receive the model monkeys on horseback. I hope this mummy's tomb isn't cursed. This sphinx is an exact copy of the one found near the pyramids, except with some of the missing details restored. When we ask museum visitors to vote on whether ours was better than the original, it won by a nose. But they run out of time, wow. There you go. I've got enough bricks to build that T Rex now. Yeah, well, yeah, well, uh, yeah, well, uh, what I said before, I'm still going to do all of them. Oh, okay, and then that doesn't even work. I think that broken machine that took for at least into the other that astronaut exhibit. Probably. Coming oh, soon, an exciting scary. diorama showing the many uses of hay. The Lego City Hero said, "What the crap are you doing? You just punched me in the middle of a little. I found animation. a lot of super bricks. Hmm. Maybe there's something I can build around here. Come on, drop that real quick. All right, yes, I need it. Wow. Oh, can I my dad spawned? I carried that all the way, up, all the way through, like the other side. And I'm trying to remember. I don't think I, I I haven't really been to a museum. And when I mean like a museum, I'm not talking about like those museums or whatever, like toys or like like, like a children's hey, museum. Hey, I can use them to build a T-Rex. I'm talking that about like a museum, lucky. like an actual like 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 an actual like like real museum, museum like like dinosaurs or history. I don't I don't think I ever went to an actual like, history museum if I remember. The only museums that okay, not mind. It's a here. But yeah, I don't think I've ever really been into a, 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 like an actual museum that involves like history or dinosaurs. I don't think. I always been, I always went to a museum like where they have like toys or like, like 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 activities like a few years ago. But I never been like one of these kind of museums with the dinosaurs and stuff. And even when, and even I go, I'll probably still have fun just because of how entertaining. Because I don't think I. I don't think people really go to museums anymore, but I don't really know. Probably. They probably still do, though. Not, I'm not gonna lie, it's not, it looks pretty cool. This diorama depicts Robin Hood's less popular cousin, Robbing, while he also stole from the ring. Never really got around to giving to the poor, probably because he been stealing from them, too. I have my question. Oh! I missed. Yes! Bullseye! That's not really a bullseye, but whatever. I'll take it. Alright. This is broken. All I do is basically hit those. Knees. Like, all you gotta do is basically hit, hit the, um, the gray part, the gray level brick. Wow. This diorama depicts two cavemen inventing fire. The wheel. Uh, uh, Due to complaints of inaccuracy, uh, we have removed the third caveman, previously I shown missed. inventing the laptop uh, computer. I missed again. H how do I miss a week through it? There hey, I just reinvented the wheel. Oh yeah, there is the wheel. I don't think that was a lit, uh, whatever, super brick. I know why it showed these glitches of where it shows like a little speed, speaking box above the machine. I don't know why it's probably just a glitch. I don't, I don't think I remember that from the original. 
detective. Look how dope that is, y'all. Let me see what this guy had to. The stupid guy had to say about it. Tyrannosaurus Rex was one of the largest carnivores to ever live until the birth of my uncle Dave, who can put away a meal like nobody's business. All right, let's do this. Let's ride it. Paul. Oh. Look how dope that is, guys. That's right, Chase. Keep it low key. Y'all yeah, about to see what's going on. Goldberg's 27 out of, I oh know, 28 out of like a mini, like 400 or whatever. Alright. Like, watch, they're gonna be pretty dope. I really wish that, um, in my opinion, I really wish that um, they can make this in like an actual vehicle to go roam around. So when you play this mission, sure it's gonna kind of roam around everywhere, but you can't really like roam around like the whole map. I got the T-Rex like, out of really the museum. Can. Do you want me to take it to your private buyer? Nah, he don't want anyone meeting him but me. I'll show you the location of the drop-off. Okay, Vinny. Hey, I know you're eager, Chasey, but this guy's bad news. Tell me about it. Sure. He's real impatient. Like he needs all this stuff yesterday. That is all business has changed. Time was, you took stuff to make a profit. But this feels different. Like there's something bigger going on. Yeah, listen to me. Going on like my mother. Just drop off that T-Rex. Hey, Chase, are you busy? Well, I'm kind of. Great. Are you getting close to finding my dad? Uh, yeah. I'm on a job for a guy who I'm sure is working for Rex. Once I find Rex, I think I'll find your dad. You really think Rex has my dad? Is it because I testified against him? Rex is the kingpin. He must have something to do with your dad's disappearance. Uh, but I don't think it's because of your testimony. If it was, he'd just grab you, right? That's what I'd do. What? You know, if I was evil. Which I'm not. So what is Rex's connection to my dad? I don't know. But once I do know something, I'll call you. Thanks, Chase. Yeah, this is, yeah, this is such a dope mission. I love this mission a lot. Ten out of ten. But I really wish, like, I think only for this mission, only like people only roam around like so much. Because you can't really roam around like like like, like in the other districts like um, what's it called? Captain Carr and Chase and Hill Terry like things. Yeah, you really can't. Still a dope mission either way. That's what I love about this kind of mission. Go well, right here too. I imagine you could do this in GTA. <laughs> just destroying the cops and stuff. Just imagine. It's funny because this game came, way, came out like what six months before. Um, I think this game came out six months. Before GTA 5. What's that man doing that in GTA The T-Rex is at the drop-off point, Vinny. That's great! Yeah, just one more job and I can get my payment and wave goodbye to my private buyer. That creep. You're gonna meet him? I don't envy you. He sounds mean. Yeah, some people. They ain't like us, Chasey. Okay, they don't crash. have class. Do you need help with this job, then? I don't know. I mean, the other thing he wants is some boat from the fire department. I, well, I got guys who could drive it, but, uh... What's the problem? The keys to it are in the fire chief's safe. The only people who can get near to it are firemen. Whoever does the job would have to go undercover. You reckon you could do that? Uh, yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, I mean, I've obviously never done that before, but I think I could do it. Then the job's yours. Thanks, Chasey. I won't forget it. All right. I think we're up to doing another mission. Hey. All right. Whoa. Yeah, I have to get out of that car. Hey, man, give me, give me your van. This is an emergency. Thank you. 
I have to no, 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 no. give me that card right there. Hey, Chase, I've got some great news. Oh, hey there, Frank. What is it? I have been promoted. What? Wait, who by? Sheriff Huckleberry. He's made me head of tree related crime. Ah, are people stealing a lot of trees? Not since I've taken over. So, what you up to? Oh, the usual actual police work. I'm just going undercover for Vinny as a fireman. Aren't you already undercover? So, now you're undercover, undercover? Whoa! I'm going to get one of the fire department's boats for Vinny. Oh? And once I've taken it to Vinny, he's gonna go see Rex, and I'll follow him. Okay, Chase. As long as you're not stealing any trees. No, Frank. Speak later. Aye, aye! Over and out! <laughs> We're getting pretty close to that destination too. Yeah, so I do believe after we did some special assignment missions, we will go over and follow Vinny. Like, where did they come from? Well, I see, no, 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 no. I see my mind. Wait, I don't think we're going to um, see him after the mission. I think there's another rescue mission. Another, I'm going to spoil it a little, little bit. It's, it's a rescue mission. But I'm not gonna say who who's gonna rescue and they gave me a bike. But it's uh but it's but it's like a rescue mission. But I'm not gonna I was not gonna say who it is. So I think I think with a grain of salt, I think it is a rescue mission after um this boat. Get this boat. I go out. Right there too. That's funny because this um, fire station is like pretty close to the police station. You here to join the fire department? Head on in. All right. Cool. Special assignment number nine. Hot coffee. Okay, recruit, what is your name? Pete. Peterson, sir. Right, Pete Peterson. Being a fire officer is all about team effort. Team effort! Isn't that right, McGurkey? What? Don't help him. It means knowing what your fellow officer is thinking. What is my favorite flavor of cake, Pete Peterson? Uh, chocolate? Even the new recruit knows! He's kind of like Dumby. Ah. The, the, the well chief then, of police. Pete Peterson, we'd better start your training. This is, good, this is a good music on soundtrack, too. What are you doing, man? I haven't given you any instructions yet. Sorry, I, I got a little excited. Fire extinguishers are not toys. They are not to be played with. Follow me over here. Whee! This is Officer Lopez Delgado. Hola. He'll <laughs> give you your basic training. I've got to write a talk on the importance of buying the right flavor of birthday cake. All right, beat, is it? This is wonderful. <laughs> First of all, we'd better get you looking like a fire officer, hadn't we, huh? <laughs> there is a shiny new uniform in the middle garage. If you can get the door open. I guess I just pulled this lever. And just like other yeah, special assignment that missions. Been too easy. And just like um now as I was saying, I just like get out of my way. Now now, just like any other special assignment mission in this game, it does take a while to get like to the main point or like the main thing. And I'm pretty sure you guys know uh, who's going to be next. Next to Sky.
That fire, like that fire. Someone forgot to finish painting that garage door. That fire ATV. I think that won't be a point unless you unlock all the all the um, disguises. All right. That garage. Door. Someone really ought to finish painting that garage door. I paint the whole thing red. I did not mean to do that. You look as bright as a button. <laughs> okay, we're going to start things out nice and easy. Oh no, look! A raging inferno has erupted. Oh, if only huh. someone could put out the fires with an extinguisher. Gasp! Do you think you could do that? For That's great! Well done! You will be an asset to us, as there have been an unusual amount of... Well done! Wait a minute! That door is shut. <gasps> oh, and an innocent valve handle is trapped behind it. Oh, and look here, a fire axe. Do you Knife. think you could somehow use this axe to get through that door? Don't worry, you won't get into trouble. Yeah, yeah, look, yeah those are basically what the um, doors with the thing. <laughs> Well, aren't you big and strong? Good! Oh, great heavens! What the Look, heck? What the crap One of your soon-to-be comrades has accidentally turned their hose pressure up too high! But who could help him? Who might have some kind of... Bow? Yes, do you see where I'm going with this? Some kind of valve to lower the pressure. Now, when you hear that guy says he was Petey, that's a, that's a, um, that's a reference to the movie called The Shining. When the guy was, I forgot his name. Short work of that, didn't you? When the, um, Let us go to the next area, shall we? When the guy was like, 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 like breaking down the door, chopping the door with the axe. Open the gates. Uh, cool. Oh, okay. Look! Several of your co-workers are trapped on that building! Am I not the most excellent actor? <laughs> now, tell these other officers which way to carry the trampoline so you can catch your stranded friends! Go left! Now, this, now this is what happens if you don't catch Stop. them. Stop! Geronimo! Oh, wait. <laughs> excellent catch! Right a bit? Keep going right. Oh wait. Good work. What the? Whoa. Be yeah, you careful. See if you try to move up, if you try right. to move out the way at the last right second, Good they work. just slip and almost, they just hey, like, hey. Um, almost fall off. Got him. Te technically. Get ready. Yay! Nicely done. Left up. Wait there. Woohoo! And that is the last one. Well done. Now that they are safely down, we can put out those fires up there. But they are too far and too ferocious for your own extinguisher. But not for these. Yes. They are impressive, are they not? Say hello to my massive friends. Hop on to one of them. <laughs> what about? Uh, Come on, don't be shy. Uh. Excellent! The water cannon can squirt a lot higher than your extinguisher can. Can I not get that one? There we go. That's half of them! Aren't you, officer, awesome? Thank you. 
Wait, I should do the other one. And there you go! That wasn't so hard, was it? Oh, quickly! A most urgent situation has arisen! What is it? Oh, you're acting again, aren't you? Yes. Our station mascot, Admiral Pompom Muggins the Third, has become trapped on a ledge. The, the cat. You want me to rescue a cat? Oh yes. Now you will truly learn what it is to be a fire officer in Lego City. To rescue cats is our highest calling, because they're usually on top of buildings. But first, you will need some way to get up to him. Hmm. And that's what the cat, and that's how you get the cat down. Go on. All right, cool. Build a ladder. Go on. All right, cool. Um, Dad did not mean to push that Up button. you go! I hope my training's almost finished. I still gotta get to the fireboat. Then, once Vinny's got the boat, I can follow him to Rex. Okay. Hurry! It's almost time for Admiral Pom Pom's nap. Is this why there was a stinky fish in the pocket of my uniform? Yes. Also, in case you get hungry. Yeah. If you listen closely, you can hear the cat meowing. Oh, I go around here. Climb up here, yeah, I get through the window. I almost, I almost fall off from the building a little, from, for a second. from our previous mascot, Commander Claus. And believe me, Commander Claus earned his name. He was quite the contract negotiator. Hmm. All right. Oh, I forgot about this part. Yep, we have to drive the- what the crap happened? Whoa, what the- that's crazy. Okay. Okay, I'm about to fill this. There we go. I mean, the cat is not even that, um, that, not, the wall is not even that tall, he could just jump down. I don't know why you put the cat in your helmet, but whatever. It's video game, You Marcus. saved him! Okay, well, we're all done here. I'll see you inside for the chief's birthday party. There's lots of food! Wow, they've done this place up really nice. Huh, maybe if we did the same for Dunby's birthday, he wouldn't be such a grumpy pants. Hey, 
Hey, JC, how you settling into your new job? Good, but I'm gonna have to get the fire chief out of his office so I can open the door to the boathouse. I'm sure you won't disappoint me, kid. The last person who disappointed me bought the farm, you know? You mean... Yeah, even after I told him it was a terrible investment. Anyway, don't sweat the fire chief thing. You'll figure it out, kid. Everybody has a weakness. <sighs> it's no good. I can't beat it. The heads keep spinning and I can't aim my extinguisher straight. I had the exact same problem. Go away. I'm busy. I'm not crying. All right. It's gonna be pretty easy. Hey, you nice. did it! Oh, well done, man. That is outstanding. What's going on out there? You people better not be enjoying yourself on my birthday. I better not see anyone smiling down there. Wow. Um, I have to push the wrong button. I think, yeah, one, you will definitely get a police shield if you break all those presents. Uh, then I know why, but whatever. I just destroyed the whole food, all of the food. I'm not gonna be happy about them. Who would have thought being a firefighter would involve so much paperwork? Not me. There are like a hundred different farms just for rescuing cats. I know. Speaking of which, do you have a 37B? It's the one for sure. There, now you, now, you, now you don't have to complain about doing paperwork. I just hope you... You ever snuck in the Burns' office? Almost. I got up on top of the light fitting outside it. Oh, come on. But I couldn't make the jump to his office. Huh. What if we brought in a hang glider? I'd so be up for that. Okay, I think I know what I'm supposed to do. Probably need the chicken. I don't know why they spraying each other with the water. Yeah, there we go. Let me see what this is about. Oh, he can't even go up there now. Yep, there we go. Time to find this boat and sail it away. It's probably right here. Yep. Oh, that's... Oh, that's... 
I really can't make it because that thing gonna yeah blow you away from me. Get through the door, please. Thank you so much. That was very, very appreciated. Okay, there we go. Now we can get the chicken. Get in here. Uh, we swam. He swam. I used the back door because I'm not a simpleton. Oh, man. I just went through basic training to get in here. And it's a good thing you did because we're stuck on this side of the fence. Uh, yeah. And we can't open that big door to get the boat out of here. Leave it to me. <sighs> like we have a choice. Ah, uh, I like him. The reason why they add these, um, like, open these doors again so that, like, just go back and do the little, um, things. The little, um, festival for people to touch. Alright. Cool. Then you have to get on there. No, you don't get on there. Oh, no, there's that thing you have to use. This thing is not really that necessary, just to be honest. The boss said you should get on the water cannon. And I'm gonna fall through. Get on the boat already. We got to move. All right. Almost done that. Mm -hmm. I almost got the Lego City Hero, but 